going to sugarcoat it, guys. I'm here with Eldervine and we're going to make donuts. Hey. Well, we're going to fill donuts to be specific. Are you excited? Yeah, I'm buzzing. Okay. Hello, Catherine. Hello. What have you got there for us? I've got some vanilla custard. Wow. And I have some raspberry jam. Okay, so we've poked holes in all these donuts. Poke it into the hole. And that is it. Oh so we've God. done the whole. Simple. Are you ready? Yeah. Go. What drives Elle Devine to do what she does? I think right now, like since I've started putting stuff out and people have started connecting to it, I think it is the people that support the music, the fans and stuff are really like, they, they're really inspiring me at the minute. Heaven is a huge iconic venue. Hell yeah. What are you most excited about about playing one of London's most iconic venues? I guess because it's like a gay club, I think that like that means a lot to me. It's like it feels really good to be playing it um, with the community. Gay, yeah, totally. And yeah, I, I just can't believe I'm playing it. From going to the courtyard like last month to doing heaven, it's crazy. I'm not as good as you, am I? Oh no, that found another hole. That's like. <laughs> <laughs> it's so important what you've been doing for the LGBTQ plus community because you have been talking so much about it and helping people, like, which is crazy because you're so young yourself, helping younger people with their sexuality by singing about it, by o being open about it. When I just think back to when I was at 15, 16 and like struggling to come to terms with who I was, um, I would have really, really appreciated an artist who is so open about their sexuality and I think like now is such a great time because there is so many artists doing that. Is there a video coming for Naked Alone because we deserve one? I mean I don't know because then if it doesn't happen then <laughs> but I've got a cool idea. Yeah. It just needs to be like mad as fuck. Okay. My inspiration is like, sounds weird but Charlie and the Chocolate Faction. Oh my god, incredible. <laughs> okay. Would you rather be naked forever alone yeah. or naked forever surrounded by people? Surrounded by people. Definitely. Fair enough. Imagine having no clothes. But what would you say every time you met people? It is what it is. It is what it is. <laughs> it is what it is. What do you call a cute donut? Adorable. Because <laughs> it's dough. Don't look at me like that. Obviously in the world of music, it's not a lot of time for dating. But, well, I mean, correct me if I'm wrong. I don't know, but what I'm asking is when you're on a date, if someone asked you a question, if someone told you a joke like that, would you walk away immediately or would you stick? I, I think I'm the person that's telling those jokes, so. Oh, <laughs> so and everyone's maybe. hearts just melted. <laughs> Do you know that when the next release is going to be? The next release. I have to, um, hopefully before the end of We need more music. Yeah, we, need we it. do. Hopefully before the end of summer. But like I said, I need a, need a video well, we for Naked Alone. Had, so. We need a video for Naked Alone. See. We need a 2019 EP. Just saying, just okay. saying. No just saying. Putting it out there to the universe. Yeah. Eldervine, have you enjoyed uh, donut making? I've loved it. I've loved every second of it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs>